I want to start off by saying how embarrassed and ashamed I am for disappointing my family. A contrite Cody Riley, LeAngelo Ball, and Jalen Hill faced the cameras back at UCLA Wednesday. They returned from China Tuesday evening after being detained there on suspicion of shoplifting. All three young men admitted to breaking the law. What I did was stupid. There's just no other way to put it, and I'm not that type of person. President Trump spoke to his Chinese counterpart directly while he was visiting the country last week. Mr. Trump said the young men were facing 10 years of jail time under Chinese law. I'd also like to thank President Trump and the United States government for the help that they provided as well. Riley, Ball, and Hill are suspended indefinitely while the university conducts a review process. The three student athletes will not be permitted to travel with the team and won't suit up for home games either. My expectation is that they will work hard to demonstrate why they deserve to be a part of this program. School officials remained silent last week while the students were detained. UCLA's athletics director told the media the theft occurred during the players' free time. Jello, Jalen, and Cody used that time to visit several stores that were adjacent to the hotel. It was at that time that they took the items from three of those stores without paying for them. UCLA says it still has to determine who is responsible for the expenses incurred while the students remained in China. Danielle Nottingham, CBS 2 News. And UCLA says it was the school's decision to have the students remain at the hotel out of an abundance of caution.